Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Heroes of Might and Magic 6. I am choosing uh, my... This gives luck, as far as I know. Well, destiny, whatever. And this is what I know. I like money. Thank you. Okay, so, welcome back. Uh, so glad you're here with me, part 5. Yeah, that's a lot of videos with me. I'm so glad you did that. Because I'm not sure I'm that good. Um, so yeah, we're going to be doing the second map of the introductionary campaign. Which is called The Emperor's Will. Yes. Um, hopefully it gives the uh, the videos, the um, cutscenes at the start. I tried this once before. like I just did, actually. And it didn't give the cutscenes. But I had done restart and not start so maybe it'll, it'll give them it didn't give me the choice of the dynasty um, bonus either so yeah probably gonna be a cutscene and yes that's cool I'm getting views that's so awesome but no comments again yeah I would so love for comments something you know feedback to know what people think. I just have to guess from the views. Okay, I have a lot of views for part one and very little for the rest, so yeah, part one not that good, I guess. I got three views for both the third and fourth parts. I'm like, yeah, okay, two, three people kind of like my stuff. Okay, cutscene, please. Yeah! <laughs> Oh man, they aim low. Okay. Cut them down! And post the Imperial Decree in case that orc-loving Slava sends a scout! I don't like you. We are enforcing the Emperor's will. Slava can't lift a finger to stop us. I wouldn't bet on that. So my friendly neighbor Gerhardt has started another war. The Dragon Guards were drunk the day they granted him a duchy. But I'll give him this. The Wolf Lord is clever. My family is safe here, so he draws me out by attacking an old friend. Valeska, I am defying Gerhardt, not the Emperor. Kral has been a good neighbor and ally. I see no reason to start butchering his tribe. But the Duke of Wolf holds a decree from the Emperor, allowing him to drive the Orcs out of the Empire. Yes. How convenient that he starts on my lands. Duke Slava, I instruct your children in the ways of Elrath, the Dragon of Light. Loyalty is one of his highest precepts. What example are you making for them? You speak of religious theory. But now you are the student, and the course is political practice. I will find Kral and see what can be done. Go to East Talon, make sure the children are safe, and tell Master Jorgen to prepare for a siege. Gearheart would never attack your capital. <laughs> How much are you willing to bet? Naive. Go and see that the duchy prepares for war. What a naive girl. So yes, we are starting this, and I got the cutscenes. We Wolves at the barn door. Okay. Ah. No, get away. That's it. Okay. Flag a sawmill, flag a... Yeah. Kill them, then... Is there anything that's gonna... Yeah, they're gonna fool me. Okay. Can we build stuff? Yes, okay, we can build... Um, loophole tower. Wow. <laughs> okay, um... For arches and... Priory for priestesses. Oh, sisters, whatever. Um, marketplace, which allows us to exchange some resources for others. Once it's built, I'm gonna show you because use that and abuse that as much as you can. I am. What do I have? I have 20 of those too, so I'm gonna get priestesses. Oh, can't upgrade this. Sisters. I'm gonna recruit, and then I'm gonna go recruit this. A little bit of lag. Don't like that. Okay, they want me. Accept. Get the resources. Experience. Oh, yes. Talking about which. The options are all open. Um, yeah, I should explain that too. Okay, so. Do, um, 
So there are several actions in the game that are going to give you either blood points or tears points. Um, tears is, uh, well basically they allow you to uh, specialize, like you have you have um, tears abilities, you have blood abilities, you have neutral abilities. You can use any of them anytime whether you go tears or blood, but if you're going blood, the blood abilities are going to be more effective. If you go tears, the tears abilities are going to be more effective, etc. You also gain um, powers according to where you go. Um, tears, the tears side basically tends to be more defensive, while the blood side tends to be more um, offensive. And uh, yeah, you have kind of have to make a choice like that. It's your reputation. And now we have unlocked everything in this. So I always take this because I like getting lots of experience fast. I usually take this, but I'm not gonna right now. Uh, reinforcements is good. I've never actually used it, <laughs> but I kind of like it. Tactics I love. I want that because the auto placement is bad, and I don't have another ability point. It's next ability point. This is magic. This is all might abilities. My guy is a might hero. If I go into magic, I don't have the third tier of uh, ma of spells. But that's how you learn spells too. You you put ability points. They completely erase the whole um, magic guild stuff, which is uh, whatever. Not sure what to think of it yet. I'm um, gonna go tears if I have a chance because heal. I yeah. I'm gonna go for more healing. What's that? Yeah, that's the one offensive ability for light magic. Yeah. Get attuned to the sort of griff and how do you do that? Oh. I think you just need experience to do that. The sword is here. Yeah, you um you keep some quest uh not some quest but some uh, artifacts from the last map to the next. If I remember correctly, they were all set um items. So yeah. I think that's the criteria for it. What's... Oh, core creatures plus one, because I have two of the set. Cool. And level one. Wow, a hundred thousand experience. I just barely scratched that. Um, I need... I need um, mines. Give me your mine. I built. I didn't put the... Well, oh, dang. Come on. Thank you. There's an X that means I can't do anything in it. Slava! Wilf burns villages. Says orcs must go. Okay. Not while I'm Duke. Give me time to fortify this castle. Then we'll hunt wolf heads together. Good. Slava and Crawl ride to battle like old times. Break many wolf skulls. Also like old times. <laughs> By the way, it's highly likely that I'm that I could be interrupted by little children that are more or less being babysitted. I'm not the only one babysitting, sitting, but you know. So uh, for you, that's just going to translate into some fancy editing. But if you're wondering what the hell, why did you cut something there? Probably because some very young kid just decided that he wanted to show me sort of thing, something or something like that. You know, just saying, oh right. There are arches. I just put the defensive position of yeah, whatever. Um, um, they're gonna attack sisters. So what the reinforcements do is um, they give more creatures to whatever you are doing. Yeah, see, they're attacking this. The creatures don't stay at the end of combat, however. I uh, should have put them there. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, so uh, the creatures don't stay at the end of the turn, so really they're just there to be. Um, to eat some damage and to add a little bit more damage. But in this case, I'm really using them to reduce the damage. Eat the damage. That was entirely unnecessary, though, apparently. Wait up. They'll just do it. That was easy. Could have 
cut them out, but I showed a new ability, so I'm gonna keep that in. Yeah, I didn't cut any... what? Deal a thousand points of instant damage with a hero ability. What? He didn't do a thousand da- What? That, what kind of bug is that? I didn't do a thousand damage. Wow. Yes, I'm not much of a headquarters. Even as a mausoleum, it has seen better days. Come on, let's fix this place up. Oh, that's a mausoleum. Well, yeah. Duh. So yeah, I didn't cut any battles out in the first map. Like I said, I would eventually, but that's the first map. It's really small. Oh, I can build a basic fort. That's fortifications, and it increases uh, creature growth by one, which is okay, I guess. I prefer to just get this. Much more important right now. Improve. Oh. I'll get guild if I build the fortifications. That's fine. I need wood. Badly. No wood there. Damn it. Come on, where's wood? There's wood there. No wood there. So far. Griffins, you won't come with me. Dang it. They're, why do they hate me so? I'm the griffin guy. And I have no wood, so... Oh, I have two wood. Do this, and next turn I'm gonna be able to abuse it to get the wood I need to do whatever. Gold. Because I kinda need gold right now. To use the marketplace. And uh, okay, I can't build anything. It says I can't build anything, but I have marketplace, and marketplace is awesome when you're not totally misusing it. So yeah, this is what you're giving. This is what you're getting. You get one wood for each twelve hundred fifty gold. Same thing applies here. You get one wood for each five stone. You get one wood for each two crystals blood crystals. That's silly though. That's... Oh, it's just crystal. In... No, it's blood crystal. It's silly because the crystals were always like red, pink, really. But as soon as they become blood crystal, they become blue instead of red. Ridiculous. Just saying. So, um... This and this. How much do I need? Maybe it's just gonna give me to No. Next time I'm gonna do this because I'm not gonna have five wood with the, the no you see but I'm gonna do the two more that I need get the two I should pronounce better that's something I I noticed with my videos noticed by myself because no one's commenting uh, please comment if you're watching this I mean you are definitely watching a lot more than just the first video if you're watching this so if you're interested and you are most likely by now from being there um, please feedback would be so welcome and liking and subscribing if you want but really uh, commenting is what I really really would like right now okay ghouls you know what that's better because why expose them really that's not logical mm, whatever And they can get to me, but you know what? Uh, let's take care of them some other time. Or not at all. They're totally gonna die. Now. Easy. Should've cut that out, actually. Okay, you know what? I really need to start cutting stuff out. I, c I need to stop talking when I'm entering a battle. This I'm gonna keep in, because that's the first time we see uh, Griffins, but I need to stop talking when I'm entering a battle, and then decide if I'm gonna keep it or not. If I'm not, if I have five wood, really. Uh, dang it. Okay, whatever. Give me gold. And I have wolves. You're gonna say something? Or just be fancy?
Good. Mm. No wolf puppies will take the castle while I'm gone. Now it's time to take back my duchy. Quite honestly, the walls do nothing if you don't have a creature in. Like, the wolf puppies could just take it if I don't leave creatures in. And even then, the simple wall fortifications don't do much. At all. They don't have any defenses of their own. Your creatures need to be good enough to take out their creatures, because if not, then it's just a matter of time before they just bre breach in and kill you. So yeah, walls, not doing much, Slava, I'm sorry. And yeah, I need to like stop talking when I'm entering a battle and decide if I'm keeping it or not, if I'm... Yeah, see, okay, this pursuing normally gives blood and leaving them gives tears. Um, I'm gonna pursue them because... I think I can do this without losses, first of all, and second of all, it's the first time we see griffins. Come on. Have to show that. Oh, Imperials. Imperial griffins. I think they didn't fix it because the I I know the eye okay. First off, let me explain. The griffins that I can't show you because they took off have this ability to just take off, like they just did, and um, at the end of the turn, they're gonna come down and do their normal melee damage to whatever target they took, and then come back here. That's their ability. The Imperial Griffins, I'm gonna show you, have the Diving Assault, which does the same thing, except it does it to a whole line, or double line, because they, they, they're huge, they take two lines. They do it to a full two lines. Except that it doesn't work, because they do zero damage, that's a major bug. And I know that the AI was um, aware of this, so why didn't it, ta didn't it take off? I betcha, because it doesn't work. But I'm still gonna try it when I get Imperial Griffins, just to be sure. Unlimited retaliation, yeah, that's Griffin thing. They always retaliate that. They always did, like... Heroes 3 they did, Heroes 4 I don't think so, but Heroes 4 is, was, was weird. Did they do it in Heroes 5? I don't actually remember what they did. I know they had the battle dive, the Imperial Griffins. Um, maybe they had it, I'm not sure. But that's something very Griffin, Griffin-ish, even though there's no real logic to it. Most likely target, so I'm gonna protect them. Oh, skydives, you know. Can you kill him? No. You can. Please do. That way, he won't take damage from skydives. Hey. I can think. Wait up. Okay. It's really at the end. Ha! Huh. What do you know? They went for the obvious target. Know your AI. It's gonna be so much simpler. Now these are gonna go here because it's um, an available target. Are they protected? No, I don't think so. Okay, hold on. Can you kill one? No. You can kill this one. Did you lose? No, you didn't. Okay, here. Flawless Assault. Kill this. And then these guys can kill them. Damn. Okay. And that's good, friends. You can never win the battle in the first turn. Because they have crazy high initiative. Like, yeah. I didn't pay attention to their stats per se. But they have really good... Um, they have really good initiative, so they usually move first, and they usually just take off, like the good griffins they are. So you can never really end it on the first turn. Strange. The road to Istvan's tomb is blocked. Is that grizzled old spirit up to something? Kral remembers Istvan. First griffin duke, before holy empire. Before griffin people changed their god. What do you mean, dragon remember? dragon of air to dragon of light. Yes. And he's still unhappy about that. Let's go look. I wouldn't put it past the wolf to plunder his mausoleum. True. Okay. Yeah. 